It's day one of the sixth annual Pinnacle Bank Championship. That is right, and some of the world's best golfers are set to tee off at Indian Creek Golf Club in Elkhorn. That's where we find three news Hour reporter Zach Williamson, who joins us with the details. Zach, good morning. Hey, good morning, Cerise and Vanessa. Yes, out here at Indian Creek Golf Club, and beautiful morning so far. We're gonna have a lot of golf in store, and. As you can see, lots of work have been done around here, right here at hole 18. You got the whole concourse area. And again, this is a big tournament here for the uh, Corn Terry Open or Tour. As this is, you know, these players are really, really good players. They're not on the PGA level. A lot of them have played in PGA events, but they, uh, you know, haven't got that PGA card yet. So this is a big tournament for them. It's a big tournament for the Omaha area and a lot of charities in the organization. Big celebration also in store this morning. Um, Mayor Gene Stothert is going to have the opening ceremony tee shot and also uh, there's going to be a bagpipe celebration to start things off. But again, this is going to be an all weekend event. Starts today, goes through Sunday. You could find all the ticket information, parking information, a schedule on the website. That is the Pinnacle Bank Open or the Pinnacle Bank Championships.com. We'll have more uh, coming up, hopefully a live interview here coming up. And actually, she's joining us right now. It's the tournament director, Jessica. Hey, Jessica, how are you? No, you're good, fine. Step in. It's been a busy morning for you. Yes. We're ready. We're yes. going to be ready. It's we'll talk about, talk about how much this event means uh, for the tour to come to Omaha every year yes. and also mutually how much it means for Omaha. Yeah, so we're so lucky that we have such a great community support. You know, the event itself is a nonprofit and our goal is always to get back to benefiting children's charities. So just making sure that we have all of our partners out here and our volunteers helping to support the event. Yeah, and some of the best players in the world. I mean, yes. talk about how good these golfers are and what's at stake this weekend for these golfers. Sure, so there are 11 individuals that are golfing right now that have their cards confirmed. So we are actually giving out the top 25 will earn their PGA Tour card, but make sure to watch that points list around 75 points because that's depending if they'll actually be on the Corn Ferry Tour next year. So that's even more important for their livelihood. Yeah, and, and, and you know, a big celebration this morning to kick things off. Yeah. Talk about some of the fun stuff we got going on. Yeah, so we're very excited this morning. We have a ceremonial tee shot hit by Army veteran Andy Koning. So uh, we have uh, Mayor Gene Sothert will provide the introduction to him, and then Andy will hit a tee shot right here from our first tee, which is behind us. And then throughout the week, on Thursday through Sunday, we're treating veterans and first responders to some complimentary Coke products, but they can come on in and join the Hero Hut. Perfect. And first tea time this morning is about 6.50, right? Yes, yes, that is correct. Perfect. And you can find all the information about the tournament, the schedule, everything at PinnacleBankChampionships.com. So, Jessica, thanks yes. for joining us. You're uh, have a good weekend. Wishing you the best. Reporting live in Elkhorn, Zach Williamson, 3 News Now this morning.